This is tutorial number six, and it covers the document types within CATIA v5. To start off, open up tutorial part number 6a, 6b, 6c, and 6d, which are located on the DVD. Now, I've created these tutorial parts just to give you a quick overview of the different types of file types we're going to be using in CATIA v5. So, to start off, each of like the part files that we're going to be creating are going to be a .cat part. So, I have 6a and 6b, which are both .cat parts. Now, when you put them together in an assembly, we're going to have an assembly file, and that's going to be our 6c which is an assembly of the two, and all of our assemblies are .cat products. So our parts are going to be made, then we're going to put them together to make a product. So when you see us selecting a product, and when you start up with a new product every time you open up CATIA v5, that's like an assembly that it's always opening up. And then finally, from the parts and from the assemblies that we're going to be making, we're going to be making drawings from them. So go to part 6D, and that's going to be our drawing. So the uh, drawing files that we're going to have are .cat drawings. So these are going to be the drawing files where we're going to create the drawings from the parts and assemblies that we've already made. So this is just like a quick overview of the three types of documents we're going to be working with within CATIA v5. So the part, the product, and then the drawing. And that concludes our tutorial on the different document types within CATIA v5.